Hey, what is up, you guys? Comic Freak here. So today for Comic Freak 301, I am doing the Marvel Legends Beast figure from the Caliban Build-A-Figure Wave. I am super excited about this video. Stay tuned. Uh, I am going to post this before my school buster. I just got this. I'm super excited to open this and reveal it with you guys and show you the articulation. So here is the packaging. Nice looking figure and front of the box. Here's the side of Beast. And here's the top, the X logo for the X-Men, and nice product shot of Beast. Here are the other characters you can get. I already reviewed Blink and Wolverine. And I just need Forge, Gambit, and Skullbuster and Jubilee, and the Caliban Build-A-Figure Wave. So just stay tuned for those. I will have those reviewed soon. Uh, I'm going to upload another Mystery Bucket video after this, so stay tuned for that also. And if you're new to this channel, subscribe, give this video a thumbs up. Thank you for watching, and let's get this thing open. And here's the figure out of the packaging, looking freaking awesome. Uh, so here's the figure. Nice looking sculpt. I just love it. He does come with a few pair, uh, accessories. He does come with two pairs of hands, so that he has an opened hand right here. Nice sculpt. I do like how they have the fur sculpted on there in the different color. Dark blue, blackish, and the blue. I like how they also have the sculpted fingernails. So, he does also come with the Caliban head. Looking nice. I do like how they have the black wash on it. Nice looking sculpt. So, here is the Beast figure. Nice sculpt. I do like how he has the hair. Hank McCoy. I, I wish that he did come with a pair of glasses or a book or a lab coat, maybe. That would have been pretty neat. Uh, so, he does come with a lot of fur. I do like that. And I will sh compare you to another hairy beast Marvel character. I do like how he has the X on the belt. You can uh, shift it around, I do believe, up. You guys can see that. And I think you guys can also move his legs pulled down. Both of them. So as you guys can see that. Pull both of them down and you can push him back up. See that. So you can get a taller beast. So let's get into the articulation. But he does got a nice head sculpt. So you can move his head this far back. Pretty far back and this far down. Full 360 on his arms. Butterfly joint. Bicep swivel, and he also got double jointed elbows. Uh, you can bend his hand this far down, this far back, and full wrist rotation. Same with the other arm. And here you got uh, abdomen movement right here. You guys can see that, and he does got ab crunch. And you can uh, twist his body around, sort of and somewhat. And he got a uh, upper thigh cut. As you can see that, double jointed knees, and what I'm mostly excited for is the foot articulation, can get his uh, toes to move up this far and this far down, and he does have ankle pivot, you guys can see that, this far up and this far back, so I will get my other figure so you guys can see the other furry beast, and I will show you right now. And here the beast is compared to Sasquatch. Looking freaking awesome. I do like how the size is a comparison. I do not have a Hulk or the Toy Biz Beast, but this is how I have to show the Sasquatch. Nice sculpt though. I like how they also have the stretching on his pants or shorts. This freaking sculpt on this is really cool. I like how they have all the blue. And if you're new to this channel, subscribe. Give this video a thumbs up. Thank you for watching.